welcome to week seven of 52 Fiddle Tunes in Kingston, Ontario. And as you can see, I'm not at my house today. I am at Martha Smith's house on Smith Road, actually. But actually, her name is now Martha Wienendahl because she married Nico Wienendahl. So we have played fiddle for a long time together. But in actual fact, I played a lot with Martha's dad, who was a fiddler around Kingston. He played... Um, at all kinds of fiddle clubs and all kinds of events. He just played oh, around, yeah, right? And dances ear. and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. And uh, he learned to play by ear at his uh, family house, right? He mm -hmm. had, they had a fiddle in the house and he learned to play and never read a note of music, right? No. And how old was he when he passed away? 83. He was 83. And how, when did he start playing? As a teenager? Or? No, he was actually in his 30s. Oh, he was in his 30s when he picked it up. That yeah. is very interesting because that is, yeah, that's kind of rare. Usually people start. Yeah. Was he married by then or not? Yeah. yeah. That is very Talk cool. Because he was crazy. A, I am I sure. How to play the fiddle. <laughs> Actually, lots of uh, my students say the same thing. It drives, you know, thank God for mutes. All right, so we're going to play a tune that he really liked and he played a lot, and it's called The Chinese Breakdown. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Week number eight.